Hey YouTube, Mr. Mods1999 here again, bringing you another tutorial on Infinity Powerboard 3.2.3. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to install applications. Um, in this case, the Shoutbox. Um, you can, uh, with this tutorial, um, the way that I do it, you can install any application. I'm just doing the Shoutbox because that's the one I had on hand. So let's get started. Um, first, open up FileZilla. Once you do that, go ahead and either do the quick connect if you didn't save it in the site manager. Since I did, I'm going to go ahead and connect. And I'm going to go into my public HTML. Minimize it. Open up the file. This shop box will be in the description for the download. Um, so you're going to want to go to upload. And you'll see two, admin and public. Now these refer to the directories as you can see admin and public. So first go ahead and go into admin, double click, go over here, get on, okay, application applications add-on. Um which is right here. Double click, then go into other, you'll see IPS and other. And now you're obviously not going to see Shoutbox in here yet because you haven't added it yet. So don't double click because you'll see all these files. Just go ahead and drag the actual Shoutbox over. And there should be around 100 files that need to upload. Go ahead and back the whole way out of this and get ready to go into public. And then after this is done uploading, you'll see successful transfers 100. As you can see, right now, oh sorry, 96. Now go the whole way back, scroll down, and you'll see public again. Double click, double click, and then you'll see two um, files. You'll see JS and style images. Go ahead and go into JS, which stands for JavaScript. Um, and you'll see two files in there, so JS. And just go ahead and do this, highlight them both. Drag them over here, and as you can see, it was pretty simple. And then style images, style images, master, all right, now, you're going to want to actually go into the shop box folder this time. And this is just for the pop up. Um, you can press a button on the shout box for a, like a pop out window. Um, so just go ahead and drag it over here. And as you can see, it did upload. Now go ahead and close out of this. Done with that. Go ahead and close out of this. Now go ahead and open up your browser again. Go to your website. And then as you get into your website here, alright, um, as you get into your website, go ahead and sign in if you aren't already. And go into the admin control panel, type in your login information. And then um, go ahead and find manage or applications and modules, and then manage applications and modules. And on the side here, you should see applications I've installed shout box. Now go ahead and hit the little install button, and go ahead and hit drop original tables and overwrite. You can you can really do either or, but I like to do the drop original tables and overwrite. Um, so go ahead and hit continue. And this is just like the installation progress, uh, process. It just keeps going through the same cycle. So you basically just sit here and wait for it to be done. It should only take um, up to a minute or so.
Okay, now you should see the um, Shoutbox installation. Welcome to the IP board application setup utility. The installation is now complete. So now, go back to your website, refresh, and then your Shoutbox is there. But you all, you do need to go ahead and set up your Shoutbox. So what you're going to want to do is go ahead and go into system settings. Um, hold on, sorry. Oh, yeah, okay. So go into members, sorry. Um, uh, manage groups, permissions. Now, you are administrator, so go ahead and hit that. Go over to Shoutbox. And then just hit yes for all these. Complete edit. Okay. Refresh. And as you can see, you can go ahead and um, shout in your shout box. Now I want to show you a few more things with the shout box. Um, what you are going to want to do is go over here to other apps. Go over here. Um, management. Manage moderators. And you um, want to add admin to the moderators make sure you click yes for all of these hit add group and then refresh and as you can see now you have two icons here you can go ahead and load the moderator options and delete the first shout that was by the guest yes and as you can see your yours is the only one that's in there now um, go ahead and go to system settings um. Oh no, sorry, here. Um, go over to other apps, Shoutbox, and Global Configuration. And if you see, it says Shoutbox here. And you can also put a message right up, up above here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and name mine Mr. Maj 939's Shoutbox. Okay, and then for the global announcement, uh, you can pretty much do anything. Uh, make it whatever color you want. This is a test. Alright, now go ahead and scroll down. Update settings. Refresh. And as you can see, Mr. Mod's 99 shell box. This is a test. You can pretty much do anything uh, for adding the announcement. On the shop box, you can add links, all types of things like that. And that's pretty much it. So I just want to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you comment, rate, subscribe. And uh, my next tutorial will be on how to add a skin to the um, board that you have. So uh, just a heads up for that tutorial. See you guys later.